Welcome to Now in Android, your ongoing guide to what's new and notable in the world of Android development. We released the third beta of Android 13. Android 13 has been built on our core themes of privacy and security, developer productivity, and large screen support. Beta 3 takes Android 13 to platform stability, which means that the developer APIs and all app-facing behaviors are now final. You can confidently develop and release your updates. Read all about it in the post. Tune in as Faylene tells us about the top three things to know about Google Play from Google I.O. These include updates on custom store listings, introducing more developers to the LiveOps beta, and new subscription capabilities. Learn about these three topics in the video or blog post. The Privacy Sandbox on Android aims to develop new solutions that preserve user privacy while enabling effective, personalized advertising experiences for apps. Now it is in Developer Preview 3, which adds APIs and resources for conversion measurement and remarketing use cases. This allows you to begin testing and evaluating impact on all key APIs for Privacy Sandbox on Android. This week on the ADB podcast, Chet, Roma, and Tor talk to Alan and Esteban from Android Studio about LiveEdit. LiveEdit allows you to update composables and compose previews, emulators, and devices in real time. This experimental feature was recently launched in the Electric Eel version of Android Studio. Let's take a look at what's been up with Android X releases since the last episode of Now in Android. We have a few new features that are stable. Wear Watch Face version 1.1.0, which contains improved editing and improved complications. Games Activity version 1.2.0, which now allows derived classes of Game Activity to handle native library loading, always loads the native library in GameActivity.onCreate, and falls back to loading a library with the name Main if no other library is found. Benchmark version 1.1.0 now includes support for Jetpack Macro benchmarks, support for baseline profiles, and support for allocation metrics and profiling during micro benchmark runs. And finally, annotation version 1.4.0, which has a number of changes to their annotations. That's it for this time with Android 13 Beta 3, Google Play, Privacy Sandbox DP3, ADB, and more Android X releases. Make sure to like and subscribe for the next updates from the Android developer universe.